Thanks, Shelley. You know, this is a typical northwest side neighborhood, the last place you would expect to see an art gallery. But once we get inside, you are going to be surprised. Local artist Olivia Villanueva loves life, which is the inspiration really for her art. Where do you get your inspiration from? My inspiration comes from daily objects. It could be anything. It could be a commercial. It could be a saying that I hear. It could be even through uh, my children, my mentor. One thing that really inspired me, it's music. Well, right now I'm in the process of getting ready to um, show you how I be. This is like five different colors that I mix. Olivia is a self-taught artist. She's been painting since she was really a little girl. And through the years, she's learned painting is really a process. Oh, most definitely, most definitely. I can uh, work on a painting for two years, put it away and come back and say, oh, I understand it now. You see, because it, it's a learning process. I was looking at some of this art with you earlier and you said, you know, I, I, I work it and I leave it alone then I come back and now I'm gonna add some color to it. There's a time that you stop and you put it away. So my favorite is to kind of explore and to continue to uh, figure out what you're doing because there's never an end to any type of painting that I do. From religious pieces to self-portraits, Olivia has a very diverse style. I actually like to do figurative with abstract. It's my own thing and actually I won't even finish a face. If I'm doing a portrait, and for instance, My Last Supper, um, I'll use charcoal, I'll use different, many different mediums. I love what I do. One thing I noticed, she loves bright colors. Okay, you just been doing all of this stuff. Do you have a favorite color? I mean, my God, there's 50 colors on here. Red. Red? Red, 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 red. I love gold. Gold is my, my uh, bottom color. My colors pop, you know? White, no one, you know, a white on white is one of the most difficult paintings, but what you do is when I, I go back to that white painting and I can add my reds, it'll turn into pinks. So you're gonna slap some red on here? Oh, yeah. Okay, I'm, I'm getting out of the way, go. Hey, I was wearing a white shirt. And right now what I'm gonna do is I am gonna cut my palette. As you can see, Olivia has lots of fun with her art, but a girl's got to eat, right? So if you need a fine piece of art. You just contact me and you say, Olivia, you know, I have a thought. You know, what do you think? You can, I, I, I want to hear what you're thinking. I need to get into your brain. Shelly, with nothing like doing this in your own garage and going as crazy as Olivia is going with her paint, she does some incredible work. If you'd like to know more, here's her website address, and of course, she'll contact you. Shelly, back to you.